I took things that I didn't expect to take. I just felt like I was in some cases running from who I was because I didn't want to be someone else, if that makes sense. Wow. And so I think like, in doing so, you're not allowed, you're not, I've never allowed myself. And that was partly, I think also the ADHD, this was like awesome food for it, but I never allowed myself to stop and think because if I stopped and thought that it would be too hard. So instead I just kept myself so busy and so, um, and just like in this kind of unhealthy way because I was afraid and to like examine like what is really happening and what is the stuff and there's like many layers of things and I think the other thing growing up we grew up really this is why I, I um, have in my bio that I wanted to stigmatize poverty because we grew up in poverty we live below the poverty line um, growing up and it was really hard and I moved out of my home when I was 17 I was still in high school and I was <laughs> that was really hard. <laughs> like I had to go to the food bank should not be stigmatized. Like if you need food, go get food. Like if you can support those organizations, ensure that people can get what they need to survive because I lived in survival mode a lot. I was always just trying to survive and then going into full-time film and TV and then hitting a pandemic <laughs> and whatever and a strike. And I'm like, I feel I realized that I have sunk, I sunk back into fear a lot and I would, it would seep out of me. I'll say like, I'd be on talking with people and I, I, and it's also part of my brain is like, tell everyone what's on your mind. <laughs> so I'm like, and I'm trying to be more open and, but you start to like, realize that you are being driven by fear, but always remembering like, why are you making the choices you're making and trying not to make choices based on fear. But I, I joke that everyone's like, you write so much and you're so prolific and you're always working so hard. And I said, I write like poverty's chasing me. And I would joke, but it's real. That's actually why. And having a husband who is amazing, but also comes from the same background as me, he works in the same capacity. We So it's not, I, it's interesting where I'm like working because my brain wants stimulation. But I could also just go play video games all day if I wanted. I'd also get a simulation, but I can't do that because there is a deep fear in me that I won't be able to eat 